by Paul Tisdale, Exeter City Football Club. This is Disenfranchised. Hello, welcome to Disenfranchised. Today I went to go and see AFC St Austell in Polter Park. What happened was a bit of a travesty, but there was a good side to it, I have to admit. So, St Austell had a lot of possession, a lot of good possession, a lot of attacking possession, a lot of attacks, and then were undone by a penalty. Uh, shades of St Saltash last week. No Saltash, it wasn't a penalty. But, after that, they got another goal. Great, street of winning. Right. I'm going home, I hear cheers. I didn't really. But then we scored two goals. Right. The impact of Tornado was incredible. Um, I think this is a player that's going to take uh, St Austin a lot higher up in the league. And that's a good thing. I mean, winning 5-2 earlier in the week and then the impact of this fella, uh, I, I genuinely can see some good things coming. But they scored another goal at the end, and unfortunately that was that. Street are a team, a couple of, uh, I don't know, one league up in comparison to, to where we are. So, you know, it happens. It's a shame, but it happens. Other results, Plymouth took a draw, and uh, Exeter took an away win. Ollie Watkins scored. I said this the other week, didn't I? Um, no matter what, they can't seem to win at home, but they can win away. Weird. But back with St Austell. And things are looking fairly good in the league, I'd say. So, you know, might have been knocked out of the Cups, and it's the old adage. You do good in the Cups, bad in the league. So let's uh, let's focus on the league and see where we can go. Where did you go and watch your football this weekend? Did you go to a pub? Did you go down to some, uh, a stadium for one of the games? Did you come to Polter Park? If you come to Polter Park... What did you think? In fact, on any of those other other things, you know, let me know what what your experiences were, and always subscribe here.